All right, so this game has nothing to do with these pads, which are true PX3s, as you can see, they're pro returns. Um, but because this video and all this stuff is so far in the past, I wanna just say I'm going to probably do the videos of this new gear uh, sooner, so they're gonna be way out of sequence, just because get footage of stuff like this. Because uh, this game happened in like the middle of November, it's now end of January, so just want to get some of that new stuff out there. So this game, is against a team that is kind of lower in the stands or kind of middle low. Goalie played pretty good in this game. He's just coming back from knee injury. I played for him a few times. So he played pretty good in this and we'll talk about how this goes in the rest of the game. So if you're buying hockey equipment and you want to support the channel, check out the links in the description. In the US, check out the links to Pure Hockey. In Canada, check out the links to Hockey Supremacy. If you click those links and make a purchase, I get a kickback from the sale. So anything that comes back from that comes right back into the channel so I can make more content and doing like real reviews and stuff. I got buy gear to do a lot of the tests for it. So that costs money and it would be greatly appreciated. Otherwise, if you want to support the channel without buying anything, check out links in the description to Patreon, buy me a coffee. Everything through there comes again back into the channel so I can make more content and doing real reviews. <laughs>
So this game is pretty frustrating and it's frustrating because I felt like I played pretty good. The first goal was a pass like back door and I didn't turn fast. So I was like this at the shooter and the guys back there. So instead of my body turning and sliding, I just tried to stick my leg out like this and my leg got there, but he actually like probably missed the net and it hit my other leg that's just sitting like that off my leg and in. I tried to grab my glove and I didn't. Uh, so it's one of those where it's like a kind of nice play and I just couldn't get to it in time. Uh, this, the second goal is off a guy that has a really good shot and he scored on me a bunch this year and last year. He has a, a really hard shot and it's really quick too. And he gets it bar down and I wasn't square to him. I was more in the middle of the net. I knew there was a guy like in at the hash and I was kind of playing like if he did something about it and he got a really good shot off. I need to be square to this. I could be challenging more, but if I was just square, it would just hit me in the shoulder and it would have been fine. So that's really the play that I should have done and kind of sucks. And then the third goal was a really nice pass from behind the net to a guy wide open. I, is it back door when there's like you're, it's behind the net, I don't know. But anyways, he was wide open on one side and there's a guy open on the other side. And my D was right in the middle and he makes a really nice pass to him and the guy gets it off just like that. Like standing right on the goal line, instant pass. I couldn't get over fast enough in time. This is where I'm not flexible enough. Just put my legs like this. I should kind of work on that and try to do that. Because if I was like that and not hugging the post, I might've been able to e more easily go over there. But I thought this guy was going to my glove side because he had support there and he was on that side as well. So that's why I'm hugging that post. So it was a nice play back there to a guy who's wide open, just instantly puts it in. I think it, it might hit me and go in, but he puts it in. So it was a nice goal. And overall, this was like a really disappointing game because of this. We played well and we had goals. We had like a 3-1 lead at one point. But then you see after that, all the two-on-ones that they almost scored on. And I put those clips in there where they just couldn't finish. I made a couple of really nice save, like leg pad sliding saves. There was just a bunch of plays too where there's two on ones and the guy misses and they had all the time in the world. We have the opportunity to be really good. It's just, we make really bad hockey decision plays. And I know it's beer league, but like these guys take this seriously and they get upset like when they lose and stuff like that. So you just have to use your brain. And so when they make these plays where it's a three one, there's no, you shouldn't pinch. You shouldn't, which the pinching is what is leading to the three on ones and stuff. And so you gotta play differently and they just, they don't. And it's kind of disappointing and it's just the way it is. You're watching hockeyreviews.ca.